Hello guys, how are you? So in this video, I would like to show you how to build a trebuchet. Um, we will build something similar with this, but a better version, of course. Um, I can't afford to make, you know, uh, to make it too big because the game lags already. But uh, as you know, trebuchets are used uh, to you know uh throw the stones or whatever you are throwing at a higher distance all right let's um let's begin guys let's start from the very start first of all we must uh set the machine to the ground and we must move it a bit backwards because as i said trebuchets will fire for a long distance and we need space to build it I would like to make this uh, this skelet of of the trebuchet and as you know the the first attempt was a bit vulnerable it wasn't actually the first attempt in that uh, in what you just saw was actually a lot of work but all right I will make it more solid the, the only problem I have is that uh, if I use too many blocks the game will lag And I don't want it to lag too much, but we will make a trebuchet guys. This is why you are here And this is why I'm making this video All right, there you go. Let's erase that one pointless Okay, now let's um, Let's make this This will basically, um, all right. this will basically help us to make the the skelet of the trebuchet more resistant. You know, because as you saw, we are we are using strings and blah blah blah. I tried, guys. I really tried to. Uh, to use, uh, you know, usually trebuchets have a, a big weight in the in the in the front, and in the back it has the stone that you have to throw. I tried to do that, but uh, it's not working. And if you build a trebuchet of that scale, it's very likely that the game will have one frame per second or even less so let's not take any risks yeah okay so far so good i would like to start building here a lot of blocks up ahead it's not that hard to build a trebuchet guys it's not that hard at all now that you have me to show you it won't be hard ever in this life no, oh, okay, there you go. Let's make it a bit higher. So we make sure we hit the entire map. All right, it doesn't look that stable. So let's make it like this. Good. Now, uh, just for uh, to make it more stable, I would like to make this blocks. Seven. Three. Four, five, seven, six. Okay. Wait, wait, wait. I'm an idiot. It was six, seven. Oh my god, guys. Why didn't you correct me? You let me look like a fool. Alright, seven. We make this because we want to, to increase the resistance of this pylon. To make it less vul less uh, likely for it to bend bend over all right four five one two three four 
Yeah, I, I'm bad at counting. Really bad at counting. So don't rely on me on that. Good. Now let's do one, two. And then just one. One, two. And then just one. One, two. And then just one. Oh. One. Two. And then just one. This is it. This will make it a bit more resistant. Oh, let's, let's. I'm still insecure about it. So let's be a bit. Let's make it more safe. You can make it. You can <clears throat> make these changes after as well. Okay, he's lagging a little. <laughs> so he's gonna lag after we finish it as well. Make this so you make sure it's connected and. It will be less unlikely you will um, get it destroyed or something. Let's try to use not too many of this. And inside. You know, you can patch it after. So right now, it, it would be good to test it from now and then. And if something goes wrong, improve it, fix it. You know, this is how you get things done. You make something, if it doesn't work, you rethink the situation. Wait, did it just disappear? And you make it again. Until you make sure it works. Okay. Looks more stable now. To me. Okay. <clears throat> we just need this here. Good. It works. Now you can make uh, a smaller, uh, a smaller one. I just want to show you how things work around here. Okay. Now you must test this. Uh, you must uh, check the length of this. Oh boy. We made a mistake, guys. We made it too tall. We made those pylons way too tall. Forgive me. All right. Now we must make this braces again. But this game is amazing, guys. I'm already in love with it. Okay, it's better now. It does look better now. Okay. Now, wait a second. I think I can. No, I cannot. I must make a small block here. And then a wooden block there. Now guys, as I said, we must check the length of this, uh, this stick. Oh, okay, the length is okay. It must not hit this, because you want to reuse it. Sometimes. Maybe you want to reuse it. Okay, make sure this is longer than this one. And... Make it again. Make a double row of wooden pylons, whatever. 
it will be more stable. That was a mistake there. Okay. Alright, after you made this, after you made this, you may want to make sure you uh, use braces to link all these things together. A lot of braces. Also, below. And here as well. You need this. You need it so badly. Okay. I don't know what I do here, but I hope I do well. I do it well. Good. Wait a second. Alright guys, so we have this entire thingy here. Now we must uh, place... Where is that? The, the holder here at this edge of the arm. And the bump here. And now we need some strings in order to give some boost to this uh, to this mach machinery okay but make sure to put only two strings or one because if you have too many you will um, you will rip apart the entire machinery all right let's press space and then let's press L bam it works a little but not that not not as I not not as I was expecting it to work. So I would like to make it a bit longer here. Yep, like this. And here we will need to I mean I want to make it uh, a bit heavier at this edge. Okay, I cannot build there. I understand. So I make this here, here, here. Alright, it should be better now. Of course, let's not forget about the braces. But this is pretty much how you make a trebuchet. Got this. Now let's um, let's place the holder again, and let's place the place the ammo on it. Okay, let's fire with it, and it's not working because because I forgot a very important thing. I forgot to place braces here. So it's not sustainable what I did here. It must be improved, it must be made better. Okay. There you go, as you can see. We're trying to to make everything more resistant. Alright, let's do this. And, okay. Now it should be a bit more resistant. Although I'm not sure that's why you gotta test it as much as you can. And this lag, it really messes up with our plans. No, no. Something is not good here. 
is bouncing way too much. And I don't like it. Okay. The previous version was better. Okay. There you go. Oh. I forgot this here. Or I didn't. Or this might be the problem that I didn't place these braces as I should. Okay, let's test it now. Uh, it's the same issue. But it's working a little. It's a little too big though. Too high or something. Wait a second. Let's erase this. So we won't need this anymore. Good. Right now I want to place the holder here, this thingy here. And let's place the braces anyway. You figure out... Um, what I have done here is not so hard to, uh, to comprehend. It's actually pretty easy. Alright. Let's test it now. It's a bit more stable. Just a bit. It does fire, however. So let's let's see. The trebuchets are made to fire along the uh, along distance. Let's see if our does fire. Oh, it did explode in the air. Okay, it fires everything. It tears apart in the air. But this is pretty much the basic concept of a trebuchet. If you make it. Uh, of a little scale I think you will uh, have more success and try not to place these things too, too far from each other I did a mistake by placing them 5 uh, blocks so make sure you only have 3 blocks here in the middle and it will work perfectly okay this was it guys thank you a lot for watching I hope you enjoyed it take care bye bye